The municipality of Jerusalem has drawn up a plan for the construction of 2,200 new Israeli settler units in the occupied West Bank. According to Wala Hebron News site, the project dubbed Olive Trees District covers an area of some 50 acres in Gelo neighborhood southwest of East Jerusalem. Palestinian sources confirmed most of the land allocated for the project is under Palestinian private ownership while 30% belongs to Palestinians living abroad. The establishment of settlements violates the international law, which states that any occupying power is not allowed to make any permanent changes at the territory it occupied. According to the international law, it's also prohibited for the occupying state to transfer its own citizens to the territory it occupied. Israel's continuation in expanding the building settlements is uh, violating the uh, international community well to stop such, a such actions. The project contactors recently held a meeting with Israeli officials, during which they called for immediate execution for the Israeli plan. On Tuesday, the Palestinian Foreign Ministry condemned the project, saying that Tel Aviv continues to disrespect the international laws. The ministry also called on the international community to hold Israel completely responsible for Israel's behavior, which obviously obstructs the two-state solution. Last week, Israel approved plans for the construction of 770 out of 1,200 settlement units near the Palestinian town of Beit Jala. It also opened build contract tenders for the construction of 323 units in the illegal settlements of Gilo, Niv Yaakov, Bigad Zaev, and Har Homa. Tel Aviv has defied calls to stop the settlement expansions in the occupied Palestinian territories. Over half a million Israelis live in more than 230 illegal settlements built since Israel's annexation of the West Bank and East Jerusalem during the 1967 war. Nuhar Zintrisu TV, Gaza.